I'm Maxime Coton. Uh, I'm the director of the film To Make Things Known. Um, there is a little backstory uh, to this film, and which is um, in uh, 2011, I made um, I made a documentary movie um, about my father, who is a steel walking man. We used to be a steel walking man. And uh, this movie was set in the factory, uh, and the fa factory was still running by that time. And I had the opportunity to f film him uh, on site and in his workshop. And uh, a few years later, the factory closed, and uh, I had the opportunity for another movie uh, to go back to the workshop. Uh, to go back to the empty factory um, and there I was struck by the fact that um, uh, everything was left in place as if uh, the working man uh, would come back the day after and it was uh, everything was in place like this for five years by then um, and that's uh, when I decided to make this film, uh, to make things known, uh, based on the fact that um, I had the as a filmmaker I had the opportunity to go back there, but my uh, father and his colleagues were not allowed uh, on the site anymore. Uh, so to me, the film is really linked with this idea of new ab abandoned spaces, because. Of course, literally, um, those factories are um, closing everywhere now in Europe, so it's, they are newly abandoned, but in a more um, metaphorical way, it's also this idea that the work itself uh, is uh, more and more invisible. Um, we are in a society where um, of services where you get something, uh, you get a service or you get a uh, staff and you don't know where it can come from, so you, you don't know uh, who has made it and uh, so the work itself uh, becomes an abandoned in place now. Uh, so I wish uh, you a, a good screening. <laughs>